Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Here we are again in sunny South Florida. Uh, before we get started, remember, subscribe, hit that like button, and uh, hit the little bell so you get the, uh, the updates. But here we are, and this is when catastrophe strikes. Super windy day here in Miami. All my plants are blown over. I really don't mind about that, but this is the problem down here. As you can see, my feed tube for my palm <laughs> uh, blew out for some reason and it drained my entire bucket onto the floor, the reservoir. So this is not much of an issue other than losing my water and my nutrients uh, because these are deep water cultures. So remember these keep a, wow, a little bit of a, well a lot of bit of water, probably about five gallons in itself uh, in these buckets. I placed this here because it fell out, but so everything's gonna stay alive. Had this been uh, NFT, all these things would have been without water. Um, but since this is deep water culture, it retains water in the actual containers. So basically all I gotta do is fill this back up, put my nutrients and fix that hose. But uh, this is just showing you guys that things do happen and based on your setup, uh, obviously there's pros and cons. Uh, had this been like that setup over there, plants would have wilted, possibly died, but um, I guess everything was saved. So now we're just gonna do some uh, damage minimization, right? We're just gonna <laughs> fill this back up, put it back in there, maybe secure it a little better. And there you have it. But look at that beautiful head of bok choy. This is crazy. These are just scallions. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Remember things do happen and always monitor your plants. Never give up on them. Have a good day. Peace.